When it comes into moving into 2025, uh, some of the predictions I have around where we're going to see focus from a cybersecurity perspective is, of course, AI that's going to continue to grow. But I think we're going to actually see some of the problems around shadow IT and particularly cloud adoption start to rear its head. And when I talk about cloud, I'm not talking about necessarily the large players. I think they provide really great security, but it's more when we start thinking about some of the cloud services that our employees are using without necessarily going through the right controls, without going through the right assurance. To me, I think that's going to be an area a lot of organizations are going to struggle with moving into 2025. The big predictions for me for 2025 is more of the same. Things are just moving faster, bigger, and organizations really being challenged in terms of how they use their finite resources to be able to deliver the value. I think I'm really worried that health might be a little bit blindsided. I think that we don't really know what the emerging risks are. We've seen some pretty devastating clinical adverse outcomes uh, internationally. My concern is that I think that various health services or health technology going offline in Australia will be new and terrifying. They're the, probably the emerging, the practical emerging risks where it goes from being an IT problem to being a clinician problem. We are expecting more, uh, more attacks in the space as more attack surface is growing over the time because more and more cores is coming in and more and more vulnerabilities are coming in, which means more and more exploitation is possible in the near future. So that, that is the prediction and that's why we are looking how to reduce that attack surface and we are partnering in that with Google on that. I guess my cybersecurity predictions for 2025 would definitely be related to the regulators. We're a regulated industry and the regulator is coming down, scrutinising financial services more and more. So I expect in 2025, we will hear a lot more about cybersecurity more than we have this year. I wouldn't be so game as to make any predictions other than we'll see probably more of the same, but it'll be faster, it'll be more challenging, and new threats will emerge and bad things will happen. So we just need to be prepared for that and accept that our environments need to be able to sail through bad weather. Um, because that's the weather that we've got facing.